Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Siege is now free to play. This are the minimum system requirements to play this game on your PC. This was how my game was working on my PC before, and after doing all the steps shown in this video. This is how my game works. Hi, this is Crisis and welcome to Low End Gaming. Let's get started with the process and get some FPS. For the step 1 we will change the in-game settings. Open your game and first go to display settings. Change the resolution to 1280 by 720. Display mode to full screen. V-Sync off. FPS limit off. And field of view to 70. Apply the settings and go to graphics settings. Here change the overall quality to low. Scroll down and change the render scale to 40. Save the changes and play your game. This is how my game works, after this step. Surely I got a good FPS boost, but we can do better. You can go to the settings and try the AMD Super Resolution. This is my game works on ultra performance. It was bit too blurry to play, so I switched it to balanced. You have to try yourself and find which one works. But, you know what? I have something better. Go to Documents. My Games. Rainbow Six Siege. And open the game settings file with notepad. Now, follow me and do as I do. Scroll down to quality settings. Here change everything to zero. Render scaling factor to 0.5. Texture streaming to 1 and texture VRAM limit to 2. Now, go to display settings, FSR mode to 2, and FSR 2 mode to 0. Now, change the resolution to 960 by 540. And we are done. Save the file and make sure to set the file to read only. Now, launch your game and see the magic happen. This is how my game works after the config edits. It gave above 100 frames per second and was smooth to play. We are not yet done with all the tweaks yet. Open the display settings and go to graphics settings. Here add the Rainbow Six Siege executable file. And set it to high performance. Now, open your game and then open the task manager. Here, right-click on the game process and go to Details. And set the priority to High. And make sure in Affinity all the CPU cores are selected. Now, open Steam, right-click on the game and go to Properties. In the Launch commands, paste this commands. They are given in the description below. One last thing, watch this quick optimization video for more FPS boost. And we are done with all the tweaks. Enjoy your game. Hope this video helped you. See you all in the next one. Peace out.